come back. I know it was so recent since I, I since my last video. I think that's how you say the word. But anyways, today we are going to be um fixing store bought slimes. This is the first store bought slime that I fixed. <laughs> Orange for Halloween. That's a weird taste. So here's the first slime. It's like um, a white slime, butter slime that I got on Amazon. It came in four different slimes. This is the white one. It was supposed to look like Oreos, but it just looks like white um, slime with sprinkles. But first, let's see how it looks like. So when I first touched it, it felt really hard, um, like really hard. And it was like pretty hard to get out because it was like drying up in there. But it was also easy at the same time because it just came out in one big blob. Why did that hurt my thumb? So like it was really hard to stretch. So like I tried my best to stretch it and it was like super hard. So basically, it's just a butter, like a really hard block of rubber. But anyways, let's start fixing the slime. So since I'm really dumb, I thought it would be a good idea to just smack the whole piece of rubber onto the table. Oops. Well, it obviously didn't work out, so... I went to the kitchen to put in some cold water in the container. I had to make sure it was cold so I'm not touching the water, feeling it. And then I just bring it back to the table. Okay, so I got some water and then we're gonna put some cold water into the slime to like soften it a bit. And this is me trying to flatten the slime so that I can put water on it. But then I realized I put too much. That was a bit too much. But it did get softer. I think it's starting to soften a bit. But then I had to change my setup because okay. there was too many people. I changed my setup. So now I'm just going to start softening it. So I just put some cold water in it and tried to stretch it and like kind of knead it so that it can get more soft. So it came into like a bit like clumps, but that was fine. And then I was trying to like dip it in the water because it was but just pouring it wasn't okay, that effective. So it's making some crunchy sounds like that. It's getting softer, but it's still very hard. Hard. I thought I got it in my hair, but it's fine. Also, some beads fell out. Um, some beads are like almost falling out. So I'm just gonna try to keep adding more water, and then we'll just see how it goes. So since it's taking a while, I'll just um add more water off camera, and then we're gonna. See if we can add some charms or any other ingredients. And yeah. Okay. Um, it's a lot more soft. But I'm going to still keep adding water because it's still pretty hard. Okay. So I added a bunch of more water. It, it's been like an hour. And it's like really soft. But it's also sticky. Because of how much water I put in. I put in uh, this much of water. Into here. So now I'm just going to like. Uh, mix it. A little bit. And see if it just gets. More. Like. Oh crap. It's getting like really sticky. 
seeing if it gets more, um, how do I call that? More activated? I think that's the word, but anyways. So yeah, I just started playing with it, hoping that it could get a little bit harder. Here's me doing some ASMR. Okay, um, the slime has hardened up, hardened up a bit. I got some on the paper over here, but I took it out and it was pretty easy. So now we're going to color the slime. I really want to make the slime a little pink. Okay, so my sister doesn't use this, so I'll use it. Also, she doesn't use it because I ruined it. Bombastic. By putting a consumer in it to see what it would do. Oh, I forgot that we are also going to pluck out the little sprinkles in it. How exciting. So I have some little sprinkles in a pile over here. A lot of them just like splashed onto me. So somewhere on the floor right now I'm pretty sure so yeah oh my gosh there's a little hair poking out why isn't it coming out <laughs> yes oh my god so, change of plans. I'm not going to pluck every single sprinkle out, because that's crazy. So, yeah, let's just continue dyeing the slime pink. So, I got food dye. It's actually food gel, so it's really strong. So, I'm just going to add a little bit at a time. I'm just going to add a little bit. Like that much. Wait, that's already so much. What? Um, okay. What's this? Why is it actually, like, so much? So, I want my, um... Uh, like, slime to be, like, a Barbie pink. Like, that reddish pink. So, I have Christmas red over here. That's the color of this, of the gel. I might have gotten a bit on my sister's tweezer, but that's fine. So yeah. Okay, so tell me why three tiny, tiny plucks of food gel is so much that's so much but anyways let's do some asmr this doesn't even look like butter slime but anyways just just get to mixing oh crap i didn't even see that i'm like really blind realize the thing turned off um but anyways it turned really pink it's a bit sticky but it's pink and we love pink here look at this it doesn't even look like butter slime it just looks like any other slime Anyways, this was a success. 
Okay, so I colored the slime more. Uh, my finger is completely red or pink. Um, this is the dye that I used. So now it's time for ASMR. I have like some dye on my hands that hasn't dried out yet. That was so cool. I'm so cool. Before we end the video, here are the before and after results. So anyways, that's it for this video. Um, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!